I'm Colleen Estrinos and right now in your 13 Action News update, Las Vegas firefighters rescued a woman and a dog from a house fire on last night. This was near Oakey and Valley View Boulevards. Investigators say the fire was started by a pile of wood stacked up against the house. The woman was taken to the hospital with burns and smoke inhalation. The dog also suffered from smoke inhalation. The fire caused about $10,000 worth of damage. JetBlue is looking to temporarily suspend flights to Las Vegas. The airline has filed with the Department of Transportation to pause operations to 16 large airports now through September. McCarran International Airport is one of those airports as well. JetBlue says dropping flights to major hubs would help the company financially as it tries to recover from the pandemic. And a judge has rejected an attempt to block Nevada's June 9th mail-in primary election. A conservative voting rights group has concerns about potential voter fraud. The judge ruled that the voters' rights initiative failed to establish legal standing necessary to obtain a court order to block the election. She added that Nevada's interest in protecting the health of voters outweighs concerns raised. A separate lawsuit right now is pending in state court. We've got temperatures headed to the mid-90s this Friday afternoon. Lots of sunshine, also a bit of a breeze. Some gusts from the southwest could hit 30 miles per hour. The evening will remain a little breezy, but then overnight will calm down. After midnight, temperatures dip to the upper 60s. A nice pleasant start early Saturday morning, but we'll heat up quickly. If you want to get outside, the earlier the better. 93 Saturday and Sunday afternoon. A little breezy on Saturday. Kalina, Sunday could be downright windy with gusts up to 35 miles per hour. All right, Justin, thank you. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktv.com and our free mobile app.